Hey, this is Anthony Threbzilli. Come watch Decide and Ride. Welcome to our detailed breakdown of the new Reax 215 riding jeans available at Revzilla.com. This is the Reax 215, new for the spring of 18. And if you're new to the Reax collection, incepted in 2016, launched in 18, this brand is actually launched within the Komodo umbrella, which is over top Revzilla and its sister companies. So ultimately, what the focus here is, comfort and protection that are elevated and focusing less on sizzle and more of the stake of things. So you're gonna see a lot of subdued styles across the whole line. Now, what they were going for here is really a $200 jean that ultimately elevates the premium 11 and a half ounce denim and then beefs up the Kevlar twill as well. So normally we see Kevlar knit, it's Kevlar twill. In the knees, in the hips, in the seat, ultimately elevating the protection scheme and elevating the premium nature of denim. Now, the partner on these jeans isn't a manufacturer it's actually going to be Rocker the brand because they've just nailed this category so well. If you're new to Rocker, they're out of Switzerland. They design high-end, super premium jeans that go all the way up to around the six, five or $600 mark. And as a tag team partner with Reax, they develop this jean to really stand on the shoulders of the premium manufacturing, which actually happens in Portugal, and the premium materials and denim that allows you to integrate a lot of higher-end denim with the Kevlar while minimizing all of the stitching and really minimizing the look of a hardcore technical riding jean. It's more of an everyday or stylish European style riding jean that works on the bike but also looks great off the bike as well. Now, we're gonna dive into the nuances a little bit further. Before then, let's get into the fitment. I have Andy to my left, six foot 170. He's a 32 inch jeans waist and a 32 inch inseam. You can see how this fits on him. And remember, the 215 is going to be a straight or 501 cut if we compare it to a Levi. Nice break, not overly narrow, not overly baggy. And that's gonna be one of the things, it's a little more care in that design that you're gonna see compared to the other jeans on the market that are sub $200. A lot of times you see them become more baggy and they get a little more stylish as you go into that 225, 250 or closer to that $300 range. Now, ultimately, I'd like to see a black version for this jean. It only comes in the wash blue and it only comes in a raw. I'd also like to see a jean that has more elastane and potentially a tapered fit. I hope the team at Reacts is listening. Again, take that and run with it, hopefully for future iterations of this jean. But the 501 cut should work for everybody. No one's gonna say it's gonna be sloppy, but again, it's more of that straight-legged approach. Use a size chart, we'll ship for free over 39 bucks. And I'd love it if you click our logo, subscribe to Sir Zill on our YouTube channel, leave me your comments, your questions, your feedback on the Reacts 215. One more important piece on fit before we dive into further nuance here on the jean itself. This jean comes in sizes from 28 waist all the way up to sizes 40 or 42. The waist is going to change, the insteam stays the same. And remember, you're always able to hem these bad boys. So keep that in mind. Turn and face that away for me. If we look at the side, some of the other nuances here. Again, triple stitching in the areas that are typically most burst prone, especially in a low side crash. And if you get down here towards the cuff, you're gonna see you have six inches of hemability here, but you have six, and that's because you have six inches really of this reflective that goes up. So again, you have the ability to flip it out for nighttime riding and have a chance to be better seen. Also look at the side profile. You have Kevlar that comes all the way down to here in the back, all the way around the hip, and all the way down across the knee in the front. Actually, it misses this part up here. It's just really like that on the front side of this jean. No externally visible seams. This is something we saw really rocker perfect probably five plus years ago out of Switzerland, Portugal developed, or Portuguese developed products again. And really what that does is it allows you to get the benefit of the protection scheme without having big horizontal stitching. A lot of times you'll see $100, $150 jeans that really don't take that into account. You can tell it's a riding jean. That's great for somebody that wants to look like they're wearing a riding jean. The thought here on the 215, and especially from other manufacturers, you get up into the $200 range is premium denim with a minimization of seams. Turn backwards for me there, Andy. If we look at the back, two belt loops versus one to match up with the Reax jackets with the double belt loop to keep things in place. And if we look at the seat here, remember fully Kevlar twill covered, light accent stitching around the pockets, light Reax logoing. Again, stealth bomber Batman doesn't want to be in your face, wants to be gear that you can wear off the bike and enjoy, but will perform on the bike, especially if you need to do its job if you happen to go down. Come back around to the front for me there, Andy. If we look at the front, React twisted grip logo here embossed on the on the button. It is going to be a zipper, five pocket design. And again, this is going to be a 501 cut and, and this will be the faded or the washed blue. The next step in your journey 
is to not take my word for it. Click the info button on your desktop, your mobile device. Visit the product detail page at RevZilla.com. Read other rider reviews. You should not take our word for it. See what other riders that are beating the crap out of it, wearing it every day, are saying about it. As always, we'll ship free over 38 bucks. If you want to talk to a gear geek, see us at RevZilla.com or 877-792-9455. Thanks for watching our detailed breakdown. Remember, subscribe to us at RevZilla on our YouTube channel. Send today with our opinion, latest and greatest in the motor universe. I'm Anthony. We'll see you next time.